Well, I don't know what I was expecting, but uh, none good. Hey guys, welcome back to the Sonic Fan Game Showcase and Sage 2022. This time, I've got a weird thing. Now, I don't want the creator to take any uh, take any of my, uh, like, my, my making jokes personally. I'm just kind of, you know, <laughs> you know, I'm just kind of, I'm just kind of weirded out. So, we're here with Sonic Ring Worlds, more like Sonic Ring Worm. <laughs> I had to think that one up for a little bit, but anyway. Uh, this is another demo-like thing for the Sega Saturn. So, this is running on real hardware. And as Shadow Jackal, its creator, described it, it's kind of like a test room for kind of like a Sonic Adventure-like game on the Saturn, which is interesting to see, but as you can tell, uh, it's very interesting. It's just a test world from what I've read, but it doesn't look bad. There's a, there's a red boy. I... I mean, sure, there's a lot of, uh, what's it called, just, you know, test gear up top, but that's just mostly because it's a very early demo. But I think, I mean, from what I'm controlling right here, like, sure, the it looks a little bit funky, but that's definitely fast for Sonic. His turning is kind of crap, but, you know, it's it's not bad. It's not bad. The graphics, even though, like, the ground looks like shit and there's just blocks on the wall... Sonic doesn't look half bad. Sonic actually looks pretty nice. Missing some animation frames, I'm guessing. But it doesn't look bad from what I see, like, what it is right now. It kind of feels like a, uh, kind of like a bigger version of the Sonic World engine from Sonic Jam. Uh, there's just some strange problems. Like, you know, the whole jittering of the camera. Uh, whatever the fuck's going on here and just... His animations but it doesn't feel bad to play and i will remind you i'm playing this on real hardware i'm not playing this on an emulator so that's why you're seeing no lag it could be different on an emulator but i'm not sure but i want to show you guys uh how to jump yeah it you can jump I don't know how I got what was happening at the beginning of the video to appear, but somehow I got him just like rolling in midair, and I was just, I left that thing on for like 15 minutes, and I was like, why the fuck won't it stop? <laughs> There's no music. Uh, the control pad, uh, it's not working. Only the D-pad seems to work, which is fine, but we need to, we need to try some of these slopes. Uh, okay. Now just showed some new numbers to me. I, I, I definitely like negative uh, 0.97563. That's definitely one of my favorite numbers. I need to try and jump off a slope. Jump! Okay, not bad. The, I also have no idea what a lot of these things even stand for. Like polygon, frame 10, level. I don't know. It starts also... Okay. It's okay, Sonic. It's okay. I know you're having hard times. The crack you've been doing. You just need to stop, man. Rings can't help you anymore. You need to settle down. You need to jump. Also, I don't know how he's jumping like that. Because, also, uh... Yeah, you can turn the camera with R and L. Uh... Okay, I'm just gonna ignore it. Sonic, just get off the crack, man. It's just not good for you. Also... His ball seems to only... Like, when he's spinning in a ball, it likes to face whatever direction that is. Which is fine. But you should probably work on making that work. They said that they uh, were planning to put a lot more into their Sage demo than they had the time to. Which is understandable, since, you know, Sage is kind of an important time for uh, Sonic fan game creators. Just to get out their, their works and shit. So it's like having to... Uh, jump! Jump! Oh, I just want to jump. Oh, there's rings. Do I do it? Does a number update? Oh, they're just sprites. Uh, doesn't look like you get anything from rings. Also, none of the other buttons seem to do anything except for A, jumps. 
RNL move camera. Oh shit, I'm doing it again. Please, no. I don't want to be like this guy. Let me. Can I be him? One second. Don't worry. Don't worry. Uh, kinda. I want to try and take over his body. Okay, there we go. I don't know what I did. I think I pressed like Z or something and that just fixed it. There definitely feels like there is momentum to jumps. Like, when I jump with momentum, it does feel like I've got, uh, I've got some momentum from my jump. It just feels like, uh, it could be my controller, it could just be the general jank, but it feels like none of my jumps tend to ever, uh, that was bad. I think I can probably use this one to probably get a good jump. I'm too low. Let me see. Is there any way to get up there? Uh, just so that I can try the loop. Uh, doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like it. Um, I'm going to try again. I think I just need more momentum. And that's good for a game to, for a Sonic game to have momentum. Because that's kind of Sonic's dealio. Hmm. I think you can only jump when you're not moving. So... Maybe it's just that my controller's fucked up. Who knows? Come on. Sonic jump. It's like I have to mash shit out of the button. Okay. Come on. <gasps> I'll make it. There we go. I did it. Come on. Let's do a loop. Uh, kinda. It's okay, Sonic. It's okay, Sonic. Don't worry. I went through the loop. Yay. <laughs> Still, no, 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 uh, insult against the creator. This is pretty advanced. This is a lot more advanced than the game I looked at last time. But, uh, it just needs polish. It'll probably get polished as things go along. Just kind of one of those things where you have to just kind of be like, you know, it'll, it'll get to the point at some point. I definitely like this picture. This is a good picture. Let me get out of here. Let me get out of here. There you go. Uh, I don't know what this... I guess they're pyramids? Incomplete pyramids. Uh, okay then. <laughs> I'm just like, okay then. What's that block supposed to be? I don't know how I just did that there. Uh, okay. I wonder, can I look at Sonic from the front while he runs? I just wanna, like... No, it doesn't like that. Well, I guess we'll run forever. Is there anything else to this? Bye, Sonic. Bye. Oh, no, he's coming back to say hello. Don't worry, he's coming back. Yeah. <laughs> kind of works. Um, I'm going to look at their thing again. So Sonic Ring World. Uh, you use Yaboze. Let's see. It's planned to be a SA1-like Saturn homebrew game. Uh... There's supposed to be a skybox. I don't have a skybox. Eh. Maybe maybe I just didn't burn the game correctly, but I don't have a skybox. The skybox looks nice, I guess. But I think that's just about it. They in the uh, the FTX uh, HQ or the fan, Sonic Fan Games HQ post, it shows a uh, like a weird castle area. Kind of looks like Lost World. But yeah, also, Sonic, please, Sonic, what the fuck, how the fuck is this going, dude? It seems like the camera can't take Sonic's speed sometimes. Like, if Sonic's too far away, the camera likes to give up. Come on, you see, I'm doing it, I'm doing a real Sonic game. I mean, this isn't bad when it works well, it works well. Can I get a, Wee! I wish there was a roll button. Like, you know, hold it down, turn into a ball. But yeah, I don't... Oh, ooh, it was looking... That was looking smooth for a second. Oh, no, I'm doing it again. Well, uh... I think this is a good moment to end on. Uh, sorry if this was a little bit shorter, but there's not much to talk about. But I definitely wanted to look at the two uh, Saturn games that were talked about this year at Sage. Just because I like actually using real hardware to want to play a fan game. Because it's like... What would be cooler? Playing a Sonic fan game on your PC or playing a Sonic fan game on, like, your Saturn or your Dreamcast? Because 
that's a little bit more impressive in a way. Impressive they were able to work with the tools they were given, because there's probably not that many tools for this stuff, so I don't know. Either way, I don't have much else to say. Not sure what the next game I'm going to be playing on uh, Sage this year is going to be, but it's definitely going to be something. Shout out to... Let me get his name right this time. I think I got his name right anyway, but still. <laughs> Shout out Jackal. It's got promise. I hope that next time they're able to show this off, they've got levels to show off and they're able to fix the choppiness. But it feels like that's just stuff that's just... Like, it'll get fixed over time. It's not a thing where it's like, oh, this is a, like, a hardware problem. I think it's just like, maybe it is a hardware problem. Maybe just Saturns themselves just can't learn to take it. I don't know, but... If there's any differences between it uh, on emulator versus it on uh, console you've seen here, you can tell me in the comments. But, you know, I'll be seeing you guys next time on the Sonic Fan Game Showcase.